with Jonathan Davis and Evangeline Lilly. Give it up, everybody. I'm so stoked to have this next guest here. She makes the most stunning cakes I've ever seen, y'all. They're gorgeous. Look at these. Every branch, every flower, every petal looks so elegant. It's so cool. She recently did Lily Collins' wedding cake. Um, and actually, in the past couple years, I've actually hired her to do cakes for a few parties for myself uh, and my family. But we've never met in person until today. So this is crazy. Um, everyone meet sugar artist and celebrity wedding cake maker, Kelly Gray. Give it up. I remember, I've only emailed. Yeah. I've only emailed. It's been great to finally meet you great in person. Meet you too. Yeah, meet Evangeline. Hi, Hi. Nice to meet so you. Nice to Do y'all decorate? Have you ever decorated a cake? Have you ever made a, like a serious cake like this? Have you ever done this? Uh, <laughs> you know, <laughs> they don't teach this in school. They don't teach you that. It's a little it be a first time for me. Yeah. yeah. Well, my you're... sister does this. Oh, really? What? My sister. I've seen it done. I've never done it myself, but I know how hard it is because I've watched her try to work with fondant, so I'm very intimidated. Oh, yeah. I am so intimidated. <laughs> um, so all of the details on your cakes are edible and handcrafted, right? Even the paper is edible, right? Yes, it is. Every, every element you see from the leaves to the berries to the flowers, every part is made by hand from sugar. And I thought it would be really fun today. Like to the show. flower is sugar, you guys. Nuh -uh. <laughs> it's all sugar. No, I assume the flowers were fake flowers. No. No. All sugar. They're like oh sugar flowers. Wow. I don't understand oh it, but I love chemistry. I would have really been into chemistry if this was an option when I was a kid. Um, well, get us started. How do we do it? Okay. I know. Can I eat it? <laughs> uh, yes. I want to eat so it. So what we're going to do today is we're going to recreate this tree bark element that yeah. is on the cake. Mine's going to look identical. <laughs> we're going to do this tiny one right here. So in front of us, we have a piece of fondant that's been rolled out to the dimensions to cover the cake that we're going to be covering. So fondant might seem intimidating to yeah. some people, but it's not. It's sold at any craft store. Yeah. Yes, it is. <laughs> it is intimidating. Yes. So you can go to any craft store and pick it up. Okay. So what we've done already is we've taken a paintbrush and painted a little bit of water onto the fondant. We've used wafer paper, which is an edible paper yeah. that you can buy online at a craft like so wait, specialty food store. What is this though? What did you paint with? So these are petal dusts. What those are is a pigmented powder that we're going to use like paint. Okay. 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 <laughs> so we're going to take um, one of our paint brushes. Okay. I'm going to start with my largest so that we can kind of get some coverage and I'm going to start with the okay. lightest color. Oh. Okay. Right. Okay. And we're just going to gonna go start brushing oh. it on. Super simple. This looks hard, but it's actually very easy. Okay, and then do you start to incorporate yeah, so the other ones? Then you're gonna work towards the medium and you wanna start getting inside all the little cracks and crevices. Okay. And kind of just making some depth and dimension. Okay, okay so, so, then so then now you do you're the dark, gonna, dark? Yep, and then so the dark, you just wanna put just in the crevices, oh. just to give it that, yeah, really that cool. look of a deeper, Try the I, I love that that's what I did with the other one, but yeah, I'm gonna layer. <laughs> After you're done painting, mm -hmm. making it super pretty, this is great, looking great. Totally, I feel solid. We're gonna take the edges and we're gonna carefully tear off oh, okay. the edges. So this on is purpose. Gonna, yes, on purpose. To make it look like just stress. Really rough, like okay. this is where we're getting that really raw edge okay. that you okay. would find in the forest. And by that you meant this is where we finally get to put something in our mouth. I don't know if you yeah. mean what. Oh, I've been <laughs> and by that okay. you mean taste test. You can try it. Okay, so now we're just gonna pick it up and okay. we're going to wrap it around okay. our cake. Oh, keep up, keep well, up. Step one, I'm <laughs> keep up. back wrap. here. I'm still painting. Okay, what do you do with the top part? Because it's kind of looking. Yeah, so this I would normally tear off as well. This okay, is you just tear the top. For us. Okay, yep, so top. you can tear the top off as well. Okay. Yeah, we yeah. just want it to look like a tree stump. Can we taste it now? Yeah, I know. I'm like, when do we get to eat? I, I know there's a piece here, but I'm going right into mine. Oh, yes, do it. I feel oh, like mine is fun. Powerful. Just this do is, it. Wait, wait. Yep, here we go. Hold what? Hard. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. That's amazing. These are so cool. So, oh, and it's so moist. Yeah, and so we made this lemon blueberry. Yeah. That's so Time. cool. Oh my God. You made the like, that's so amazing. Your cakes not only look incredible, they taste amazing and they look incredible. It's awesome. Check out Kelly Gray Cakes on Instagram, y'all.